hey what is up everyone it's Kevin here and welcome to Clipit. today i'm gonna show you some tips and tricks to save your android phone's battery it will be my own experience what i have experienced in saving batteries and losing batteries because i have changed uh, one battery in my galaxy note 4 this is my galaxy note 4 and i have been using this from uh, 2014 so yeah i have changed my battery because it is dead now now in my phone there is a new battery and uh, yeah you can save your battery from damaging and how you can save your battery by doing the things what i'm going to show you now so yeah let's do this it will be my personal opinion what to do to save battery and my personal experience so to save the battery first thing what i do is enable the power saving mode in most of the devices there is a power saving mode as you can see when i enable this what power saving mode does is it will disable the background services background applications as much as it can so your phone can run smoothly and uh, if there is nothing running in the background that means uh, your battery will live longer will extend your battery life will extend much longer that is the first thing because power saving restricts the background services that is the first thing what i do to save my battery and second thing if i'm not using wi-fi always keep wi-fi turned off okay so right now i have to use the wi-fi because i need to show you a few things so after that you will see there are a bunch of settings in your control panel and you will also find these settings in your uh, phone settings and second thing what i do is i turned off these settings like location make sure that is turned off because if the location is turned on it will eat your battery okay that is the thing and after that mobile hotspot make sure if you are not using it just turn it off and after that the sync sync button this one okay if you are not using and you don't want your device to be synced just turn it off if you don't know what it does okay so just turn it off it will save your battery a lot so these are the normal things what i do to save my battery and if you have an old phone and that doesn't have a power saving option i recommend you to go to the play store and find this greenify application okay this one only okay download this and use this to save your battery because it does the same thing as power saving mode does it will restrict the background uh, processes background application running in background it will stop the application to run in background and you have a lot of customization to do so just download this and you will have a power saving mode just like the power saving mode i have i have a power saving mode it does very good so that's why i don't need this greenify if you don't have a power saving mode in your phone then you should download the greenify and use this and second step is that you should never install any power saving applications because they are pretty bad for example anyone i don't want to give a name because i don't want to uh, hurt any developer because they make application to earn money most of the developer you know make application to earn the money and some developers make the application just for fun just to help so if you have installed any power saving application or something like that you should uninstall that because the power saving applications are pretty bad on the play store i know that and it's my personal experience because i have used lots of power saving applications and they are pretty bad because they always keep running in the background they eat your uh, ram processors so when they use your ram and processors that means they will eat your battery and if you don't have a power saving application i recommend you to use only this one greenify or go to the xdadeveloper.com from there search for power saving application because xda developer make awesome application for you know android so from there you will you may find some helpful application to save your battery so uh, greenify is also from exterior developers one of the exterior developer so that's why i recommend this because uh, i have used this application and it works just fine simply that's all the steps i do to make my uh, battery live longer and if you are wondering how i lost my battery that is uh, by playing games a lot here is the the biggest tip for you guys if you are charging your phone and you are playing a game then i'm sure that your battery will die within three or six months 
and that same thing happened to me that's why i lost my battery and uh, i i used to play clash royale and the clash of clan and i was so addictive and whenever i play, plug in my uh, phone to charger okay when i whenever i charge my phone and uh, i play clash royale after three months i knew that something is wrong with my phone because my phone's battery wasn't uh, lasting long like it was lasting like one hour two hour so it was just my phone was quickly dying my battery was just dying quickly and one day it died completely it doesn't even uh, you know uh, turn on my phone right now so that is caused by the if you use your phone while charging that is just not a good thing you know you should never use your phone while char charging you can do simple stuffs like messaging uh, phone calls you can do all, all that kind of stuff small task but you should never play games while your phone is charging you should never i don't know what you guys are thinking right now but i'm just sharing my personal experience what i have experienced and next tip is uh, if there is a any application that you don't use anymore you should uninstall that application because that will also run in background and it will eat your battery so you should uninstall unused application which you never use so like there are many application which runs always runs in the background for example facebook it is just badly coded application which eats lots of battery and uh, but i'm fine with the facebook because uh, if i use the power saving mode my power saving mode is so powerful it can restrict all of the background processes so whenever i'm in the application then it will work i close the application it will not work because uh, while in the power saving mode the power saving mode is really powerful if you have in your phone you should definitely use the power saving mode okay i think that's all for this one guys because that's all i know about the battery things how do i save my battery so it's just my personal opinion and personal experience what i have experienced about the android battery saving thing so yeah let's review one more time if you have a power saving mode you should use that if you don't have a power saving mode use the greenify application from the google play store i will put link in the description for the greenify if you don't have a power saving mode and i'm sure that most of the phones have a power saving mode you should use the built-in power saving uh, mode for your phone and second thing you should never use any power saving applications none of them not even one two none if you have installed just quickly uninstall them because they are always garbage it's not like the built-in power saving mode reason is simple because most of the developers make the application to make money okay that's the reason and second thing is that to save the battery you have to run that application in background and if the application is poorly coded and they want to uh, add to pop up all the time then it will drain your battery really fast it it won't save your battery so you should never use any power saving application if you have installed just uninstall it and third thing we talked about is while your phone is charging you should never play games you can do some simple tasks like messaging doing a phone calls you can do that but if you play the games while your phone is charging uh, i can guarantee that within three or six months your battery will die if it doesn't die then you will see you will experience that your phone's battery is draining faster and faster that's the sign of when you use your phone while charging so you should never play games and you should never do heavy tasks while uh, charging your phone so that's all I know about these things and I think I have talked a lot that's all for this one guys and uh, if you do the things what i told you then i'm sure that your battery will live longer it won't die faster and uh, yeah it was just my personal opinion and experience so i hope you liked it if you'd like leave a like comment and subscribe and uh, i will also put a link in the description for the greenify application if you don't have a power saving mode you should definitely use the greenify application and yeah i will see you in the next one take care of yourself and f1 Bye-bye.